Thanks, Rita. Hello, here in the East Midlands, I'm Monica Plaha. Thank you for joining me. Hello, welcome to the programme. First tonight, there are calls for a memorial to the victims of the Hillsborough disaster to be erected at the city ground in Nottingham. Thousands of forest supporters witnessed the crush 35 years ago today at the stadium in Sheffield. It led to 97 Liverpool fans losing their lives. Every year, Chris remembers the loss of his friend, a Liverpool fan who died. Sarah Hawley reports. Next, digital forensic techniques used to catch the killers of a teenager in Nottingham are being highlighted in a new documentary. Now, a young man is due to follow in his late father's footsteps and graduate as a train driver. Owen Gunn, who's 22 and from Long Eaton in Derbyshire, used to take photos of his dad passing through the town in his high-speed train. And now it's his turn as Owen gets behind the controls himself. Simon Hare has been to meet him. Good on Owen. Now, people living in West Bridgeford near Nottingham have described being woken up by what sounded like a mini tornado this morning. So the weather wasn't good this morning, Kay, was it? Will it get any better? <laughs> in a word, yes. Monica, it could get much worse, could it? <laughs> well, that sounds good. Thanks so much, Kay. That's it from me. Thanks for watching. I'll be back tomorrow night at the same time. I hope that you can join me then. Good night. Bye bye.